Bye. Say hey, Buttercup. Okay, she wants to go to sleep. <laughs> okay, so um, I just want to talk about some of the benefits of being open-minded and making sure you have an open mindset throughout your life. So I'm going to make a huge statement and argument and say that an open mind will make you limitless in life. With an open mind, you can do anything. With an open mind, there is nothing that you cannot do. Um, and I'm speaking from personal experience. I've uh, lived a very, um, what most people would say, um, an unorthodox life, very unconventional. Um, I've had a crazy life, like literally a crazy life. Um, I'm very adaptable and flexible. Um, I li I've lived with a lot of different people. I've traveled the world. I've lived abroad for six years on and off. And now I'm back as a PhD student at a world-class university. I've had a very interesting life, a very full life. Um, I am in my mid-20s now. So I know a little something, something. When I was in my tw early 20s, I definitely didn't know anything. I thought I knew something, but I definitely didn't. And so far, not so far away from 30, but I can tell you for sure that an open mind, a humble mind, um, when I say an open mind, I mean, you know, you're open to different perspectives. You don't see things as just black and white. You are open to that gray area. You're open to interpret uh, realities in different ways. Um, you understand that truth is a matter of perspective and that honestly, you know, everyone lives, every individual has his or her reality. Um, and you understand that anyone can teach you something. So that's where the humble part comes in. Right? The reason why having an open mind is such an empowering, you know, phenomenon or just thing is because you will always have options. And when you come across problems, you will know and find and figure out and create solutions to those problems that most people will not able, will, most people will not be able to do. Because you think in a different way, because you just don't think inside the box or the way that mainstream culture tells you is correct you know you'll figure out something on your own you'll be able to um, reference some of your past experiences or tap into the experiences of another person in order to come up with your own solution right like when you're open-minded, you are creative. You just don't stick to what everybody else is doing. You just don't stick to the mainstream. You, know, you don't always play safe. Like you experiment. Exploration and, exper and experimentation are very powerful practices. And you will find that the most innovative, the most genius, the most successful, and the most influential people in this world are experimenters. And they are explorers in that they live life by really diving into and making the most of a broad set of experiences. You know, like that's why it's so important to travel. Because when you travel and when you live in another country, when you live in another culture, you become familiar with another perspective, which is another way of living life. Another way of living life will allow you to solve problems in ways in which you wouldn't have access to, you know, like living in another culture and being exposed to other perspectives um, and living that daily allows you to tap into a mindset that you wouldn't have otherwise. It, you, will, you will be able to tap into a mindset 
that you never had access to had you not stretched those boundaries of your mind and of your experiences and you know read that book or talked to that seemingly weird person or traveled abroad or learned that foreign language or learned that skill or you know learn that instrument right so being open-minded makes you limitless and honestly Another way that it makes you limitless is that you're able to connect with others quickly and you're able to connect with a broader range of people. So, for example, I speak Arabic fluently, English fluently, and I speak Spanish poorly. Right? I can speak to a lot more people that now that I know several different languages. <laughs> right? I can connect with a lot of people. Um, I've lived in three different, well, I lived in four different countries. Um, three different countries outside of my home country, outside of my birth country. And now I can connect with people from those three countries and say, hey, I've lived there before. I know something about your culture. And automatically, you know, people will want to learn more about why you were there. Right? Like they, you know, when you, you know, for example, I started off in the humanities and now I'm in a STEM field science technology field right I can connect I understand how humanities people think and I understand how STEM people think so it's just having this broad range having this access to the mindsets having access to up to the mindset to the mindsets of a broad range of different people is very empowering because you understand more than most people would because most people honestly most people stay in their hometowns they don't leave they don't experience anything different they don't talk to people who are different from them and they miss out and they miss out so i mean honestly the whole point of this video is to encourage you to experiment in life and go out and learn something different about someone who isn't like you Challenge your own preconceptions or stereotypes you may have in your mind about another group of people and go out and explore life. I mean, there's, I mean, this world is so diverse, it's so crazy. There are so many things that people do, so many different ways of living, so many different ways of thinking, so many different ways of solving problems, so many different ways of enjoying life and having pleasure, you know, so... You know, in, in order to really enjoy the fullness and get the most, it, to enjoy the fullness of life and to get the most out of life, you know, you have to be open-minded. You have to be open to criticism. You know, you have to be open to people telling you that maybe how you think isn't right. Maybe it's wrong. Maybe you can think some another way. And be open to that and be accepting of it and listen. You know, it's very, very, very helpful. So, I know this is like a late night rant. I'm just sitting here thinking about some things. And honestly, this is an outlet for me. Um, I like getting on and making videos about random topics in my mind. It helps me to, you know, just get it out. You know, have an outlet, have a conversation, and see what other people are thinking about. So, yeah, I hope you enjoy your day, your night, or when, wherever, or whenever, wherever, whenever. It is when you see this or you watch this and know that, you know, the world is yours, you know, and an open mind is a limitless mind and you can do anything with it. So work really hard to get that mind open, okay? And my little dog says, hey, Budgie Cup, Budgie Cup, hey, you want to say bye? She's so spoiled. I don't even know what to do. Come here. Oh, hello. Okay, okay, fine, fine, fine. But I'll see you later. <laughs>